Good evening, fellow extremists. You know, when we come down here, the people often ask, how come the government keeps getting bigger and bigger? And I say because people keep taxing you more and spending more. It's that simple. I consider it my job, and I know Steve considers his job, we come down here to stop the taxing, stop the spending. <laughs> Two of the things we've done when we got down here is we took on a fight, we led a fight among some of our patriots, our fellow patriots down here, against the 21st Century Fund, which is nothing more than corporate welfare, and we saved you $22.5 million this year and $50 million over the next two years. Now you may not know it, but we have another little scam down here in Arizona brought to you by Governor Napolitano called Speed Cams. Those are nothing more than highway theft, highway ATMs. So I have a bill to yank the speed cams. So all they're going to keep doing, unless we keep this up, unless we keep this Tea Party and this second revolution going, is they're going to keep raising your taxes and they're going to keep overspending until we do something about it. Now, I've read the bills that are proposing to raise taxes right here in this legislature and unfortunately over in that other building, and they want to raise your taxes again, and they're trying to do it. And I've read those, and I know exactly what I did with them. I put them in the right place. This is a Tea Party, isn't it? It's hot out here. You know, countless times this year is filled. This countless times throughout the year, this plaza is filled with people who come down here to ask for more money. Always more money, more money, and you know, to the point they want us to give them more of your money. I'm a freshman legislator, but I'm proud to serve with a few other freshmen that have come down here and held the line and said no to wasteful spending and no to higher taxes. We say no to the groups that hire lobbyists and hire and, 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 and rent tents and buses and then feed hundreds and more thousands of people and then stand up and give us speeches that they're broke. You know, I am just glad to see more of you down here who are here to represent the true majority of this state. Hard-working people who are overtaxed and have said enough is enough. Listen, I'm a conservative Latino Republican. And the fact, and the fact that I can speak in Spanish doesn't automatically make me a pro-tax, open border liberal, hopelessly addicted to big government spending. So today, we send government a message. Don't mess with my liberties, don't mess with my faith, and don't mess with my wallet.